hi everyone welcome to my channel in this video I'm showing you some gorgeous ways that you can wear and style your shorts this summer time they're a very practical piece of clothing and they're a wardrobe staple for lots of us in the summer time but they can be quite tricky to wear and it's hard to sometimes style them so that they don't look frumpy but I've got loads of outfit ideas and combinations on ways that they can be worn and styled to look a little bit more classy and sophisticated one of the simplest and perhaps the most chic way to wear a pair of shorts is with a classic white button-up shirt. It just instantly elevates the outfit to look a little bit more classy and sophisticated. A pair of white shirt with a pair of plain khaki shorts. Add some tan accessories, some tan shoes, a tan bag for a really lovely outfit combination. And you could do this look with whatever style of shorts you prefer, a longer length or maybe even in a different colour. It's a look that works especially well with pattern shorts. Sometimes pattern shorts can look a little bit frumpy if they're paired with the wrong style of top, but a white shirt makes the shorts look a little bit more stylish. Add some plain understated accessories and it'll elevate the outfit. Blue denim shorts paired with a white shirt is a very classic combination, but for a classy look, I would always avoid ripped or frayed shorts. If it's too hot for long sleeves, try a short sleeve white shirt instead. It looks just as lovely and of course you don't have to tuck the shirt in you could wear it loose and layer it with a lightweight cardigan for another lovely look bardo tops seem to be slowly coming back in style again i am seeing more and more of them popping up online and it's great if you are conscious of your bottom in shorts because they do do a great job of drawing your eyes upwards away from that area and they can be really flattering if you're wide on the hips also so it's quite a nice styling idea and ways that you can wear your shorts. A beautiful way to wear a bardo top is with a straw hat. It's another trick to draw the eyes up and away from the behind if you are conscious of that area. White and blue look so lovely together. It's a very clean and fresh combination and a very feminine look. A two-piece outfit in the same colour also works very well. The block colour makes it very flattering and the neutral accessories look beautiful with the outfit. It just doesn't need anything more. A printed bardo top with white shorts can look gorgeous with more structured shorts or maybe in a denim style or even a longer length style. One of the reasons lots of women don't like wearing shorts is how they make us look from behind, but they can look very classy if they're layered up. A pretty kimono can make all the difference to how you feel wearing shorts. Wearing all white underneath makes this shorts outfit look very summery and feminine. For a more casual look, basic denim shorts and a white t-shirt looks great layered with a printed kimono. Instead of kimono, I think a shirt always works well. That way you can either leave it open or do it up if it does get cooler. Blazers also look gorgeous, worn with shorts, smartening them up in an instant. This is a very on-trend look with Bermuda style shorts and it's a look that I think any age could do. This look that Beth is wearing is stunning. The colours are fabulous together and it's such a classy looking outfit. White blazers do look particularly nice with shorts. An alternative way to wear them would be with all black underneath, and you could do that with any style of shorts. And another lovely combination is a pink blazer worn with white and beige shorts. A lightweight blazer really looks terrific with some summer shorts. A blue and white combination can look very classy and it works beautifully as part of a shorts outfit too. And you can wear and style it lots of different ways. A blue shirt and white shorts looks gorgeous together. The shorts can be any length in any type of fabric. The pairing looks wonderful together. You could swap a block color blue for a blue and white striped shirt. It's a similar look, but looks just as lovely. Or rather than a shirt, wear a blue t-shirt instead. For an alternative to a lighter pale blue, a darker blue can look quite flattering, either on the bottom or on the top. I like neutral, tan or beige shoes with shorts, mainly because they do tend to make the legs look a little bit longer. But if you do want to liven it up, an animal print shoe is a nice alternative. For a smarter shorts look, maybe for an evening out or a lunch date, you could try the Bermuda style shorts like before, 
but add a pale blue blazer over the top. It's a very smart look. A great way to wear shorts is part of a neutral combination. It really can look terrific. I do love neutral shorts outfits. I think it looks fabulous and just so easy to recreate. The shorts can be white or beige. Either way works fabulously. You can make the neutral combo work with styles you love, either t-shirts or shirts, cami tops or even bardot tops. With shorter shorts or longer shorts, and in fabrics that you feel comfortable wearing. It's a great easy way to make shorts look more sophisticated without spending a fortune. You could wear stripes with shorts to make some really flattering combinations or wear shorts in a stripe print. Vertical stripe shorts do a fantastic job of elongating the body. Pair them with white t-shirts or white shirts or even v-neck tops for a really nice summer shorts outfit or darker shirts look just as lovely. Breton stripe tops do broaden the upper body and they look great with denim shorts, a really casual outfit. And you can always layer them up with a lightweight blazer if you want some extra coverage. Or you could try a colour coordinated cardigan with a coloured stripe top. This also looks lovely. If you like more colour, a bright stripy top warmer shorts in a colour that's in the stripe with trainers also looks great. An all white outfit can look stunning, not overly practical but gorgeous nonetheless. If you're trying an all white shorts outfit you can afford to try a more fancy top, maybe in lace or just in a more adventurous style. You can also layer the all white look up with a white blazer or a kimono or even a shirt. You could just stick to a classic shorts outfit with a white shirt and some summer sandals. On cooler days or evenings, instead of a white shirt, simply add a white knit instead. Or if you do need to layer up even more, add a denim jacket. I'm sure you all know Audrey, this is a really beautiful white outfit layered up with a denim jacket and worn with some Chanel shoes. It's a gorgeous outfit and a lovely way to wear shorts. Thanks to everyone who entered the Lily Silk competition. Sadly, there could only be three winners. I have announced them on my Instagram page and also in the YouTube comment box. But in case you missed it, the winners were Melda Sharif, Cliff Slangui, and Gigi Musa. I apologize if I've said anybody's names wrong. To claim a prize, you do need to get in contact with me on Instagram. So direct message me and then I can let you know how you can claim your wonderful prize. Bye for now.